welcome back to Here We Can. I hope you're having an amazing time at home in your bubble, and I'm just here to do a quick video. So, let's get started. First things first, I want to see if you can remember what our theme was this term in Here We Can. I'll give you a clue, it starts with an R. Re... Mm. Resilience. This term, our theme is resilience. Who can remember what resilience means? Resilience means never give up. So in times like this, when we're in lockdown at home, it is super important to remember our resilience. Never give up. Before we get into our first game, let's do our catchphrase to help us remember what we're talking about. So repeat after me. Kiwi Can says, challenges, challenges, bring them on. I learn, I grow, they make me strong. Fantastic. Let's do it one more time. Here we can. Says, challenges, challenges, bring them on. I learn, I grow, they make me strong. Fantastic. Well done, team. Now, what we're going to need for our first game is a speaker. So I want you to see if you can find some music. Okay, in a moment, there is going to be some things popping up on your screen. Okay, and I'll, all I need you to do is follow the instructions. So make sure you have a bit of room because we're going to be moving around like a certain animal. Tamariki, I hope you enjoyed that game and moving around. Did you know that the blue whale is the biggest animal in the ocean? Mm, well done. So in that game, you had to move around like an animal, you're right. But I want you to think carefully. At the start of every sentence, I said one word. This word only has one letter in it. Can anyone remember what that word might have been? That word was I. I would like you to move like a dolphin. So in this next game, I want you to think about yourself and you're going to practice using the word I as well. This game is called I like and I don't like. So you're thinking carefully about what you like. It's also very important in this game that you make your own decision. Okay, so even if you have some of your family members who are playing, I want you to think about yourself. Is it okay to be different? Of course it is. Okay, so in this game, you are thinking about things that you like. This next choice is up to you. So in this game, you can either run from one side of the room to the other side if you have got space, or you might have to walk, or if you want to stay just where you are, you can give me a thumbs up or a thumbs down. Okay, so thumbs up means you do like this thing. 
thumbs down means you don't like it, okay? If you're using the space at home, then you'll need to maybe write down on a piece of paper, I like or I don't like, and sit them at either side so you don't forget which one is which. Fantastic job team, you did amazing. Let's give ourselves a candy floss clap. One, two, three, candy floss, whoop, whoop. Good job. So in that game, we use a lot of I statements. Did you always agree with me? Did you always agree with your friends and family at home? No, is it okay to be different? It is definitely okay to be different, okay? So I want you to take away today our I statements. So. If somebody has made you feel upset, what is something that you could say? I'm sure you've all come up with some amazing answers. Hmm, I'm trying to think carefully about what I might say. If someone had made me upset, maybe I could say, I don't like that. Okay, it's really important when we use our sentences that we're starting the word with I, because we're practicing talking about ourselves. I just want to say you guys have done a great job today and I cannot wait to see you back at school. So you need to remember that this term, our theme is resilience. Okay, and today we were talking all about using I statements. See you later.